Hello everyone, welcome here. In this lecture, I'm going to show you how to get downloaded and install Azure Data Studio installation step-by-step -step process. Let's begin. So open any of your favorite web browser and go to search azure azure data studio hit enter you see download and install azure data studio from microsoft this is the microsoft product and you need to choose to download from official website so go for uh, azure microsoft like azure data studio or any of the link you may go at finally you reach at the destination so click on download and install azure data studio so we have a discussed about cross platform database tool for data professionals so let's see here we can uh, able to get this data studio freely the general the latest general availability of the version which is given by microsoft and uh, platform independently we can work with that the platform which is supports for windows mac os and Linux operating system which installer and suits you and which build you can able to possibly install the softwares in your computer system yes based on that choose appropriate version for your operating system and get it get downloaded by in your local computer system and install it so here I'm going to explaining a very simple steps using Windows operating system for user installer see this one the microsoft also it's a saying that recommended why this is a very popular and successfully working yes like remain versions also those are working perfectly not that but the windows like uh, microsoft also supports to recommend that if you are using windows you go for user installer Otherwise, yes, you can go for zip file, system installer, or Mac OS file, or Linux distribution, any of Linux favorite operating systems. You may get this deb file or rpm or tor.gz file to install this Azure Data Studio software. So let's begin to start here. User installer. See, once if I click this, it is going to be getting downloaded so it depends upon your operating system how uh, it will be like um, a speed the connectivity of speed and operating system of memory which you are having based on that it will be uh, like uh, take a time also you have an opportunity to take an operating system supporting we have a taken like uh, azure data studio packages so these are the steps you can follow yeah you may follow the steps how to install step by step procedure and anyhow i'll uh, make sure to start the installation steps in windows okay so let's see our file is uh, completed for downloading just uh, like uh, what you do here always like uh, show the folder or open or double click the file which is downloaded okay this i'm clicking open so let's see what happens here yeah you will get this window to like um, license agreement so accept the license agreements and click next so the path select destination location where the data studio to be installed so in my computer system it is showing that c users admin app data local programs azure data studio so my default location i'm not changing if you want to and if you wish to change the default location what you do is like if you are familiar where it is installing and how you need to check later time if you need to do any modifications in your studio then you can change your path otherwise let it be the same path and click next to continue yeah so the select like uh, here it is uh, given an option to start menu folder so you want to get a name of start menu folder is the same yes click uh, like uh, next to continue if you don't want to create a start menu folder you just check this box so i want this uh, at a start menu item why because actually i am going to explaining a very beginners who are entering into the field also and big like uh, them also they need to concentrate in the program so let it be okay click next now here it is enough create a desktop icon if you need azure studio desktop icon you just place the checkbox otherwise you like let it be the same and add to path required shall start 
so this path is required where it is uh, in like uh, installed in your computer system it will be the registrations is going to be system class paths it will be registered so so let it be this path to be there okay and whenever you need to start your shell prompt or terminal powershell the windows which uh, where the where you will work on uh, command prompt terminal like uh, commands to be execute such time the terminal automatically take this path and use and uh, uh, works with the azure data studio uh, communication of these commands okay click next so these are the settings we have uh, did uh, till now so ready to install just click on install it will be start the installation process it's a, it's it won't take much time and uh, the mostly you will see like uh, very soon like a finish to complete the it's always saying that please wait while setup installs azure data studio on your computer system yeah see the see it's a completing the completing wizard is showing that launch azure data studio if you click finish azure data studio will launch let's see if i click finish yes wow we are receiving what a beautification yes 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 so i'm making a very big welcome to azure data studio create a connection run a query create a notebook deploy a server like uh, most of the persons are uh, installed very successfully this uh, azure data studio and uh, i hope uh, it's a very simple and easy lecture uh, i think uh, you are uh, running and uh, see in the next lecture i'll explain you how to go to connect and uh, these menu items and all see you there Thank you.